Hello my dear family members, today I am going to share the real time environment of the Accenture coding round. If you are preparing for this then stick around because I am going to break down everything you need to know. Okay, How to check your code by manual inputs, how much code you need to write, I will explain all one by one, just wait. Okay, So at first let's talk about what the coding round entails. The Accenture coding round is a crucial part of their hiring process aimed at evaluating your problem solving skills and coding proficiency. Typically, you will have two coding questions that you need to solve within a stipulated time, stipulated time frame, usually within 45 minutes. So, first coding question will be from array or string, and second coding question will be from dynamic programming tree or graph. Okay. Now, one of the unique aspects of Accenture's coding round is that you can choose any programming language you are comfortable with, whether it's Java, Python, C++, or any other language supported by the platform. Okay, the choice is yours. This flexibility allows you to showcase your strengths in your preferred coding language. And here is an interesting part in the Accenture coding round, you don't need to write the main method. Yes, you heard that right. You only need to focus on the core logic of the problem. This means you can dive straight into the solving the problem without worrying about the boilerplate code. Okay, so let me give you a quick example. Imagine you are given a problem to reverse a string or any other code instead of writing the entire program with the main method. You would only write the logic like this in Java. So uh, as you can see, the imports are already there so you can use the uh, function you can use the class methods by default okay and there is no main method showing this is the function which is to be implemented and here you have to write the logic okay whatever language you select the problem will the, the template will be shown like this okay so main method will not may not be shown just you will have to implement the logic here okay so sometimes one case is there where main method you have to write by your own that means in only in case of pattern based question you have to write the main method okay nothing else so now let's talk about the manual input so there's a checkbox feature that allows you to test your code with your own input this is incredibly helpful because you can verify if your solutions works before submitting it okay so let's go back to the real time example so as you can see you have a checkbox you have to check it okay so try your own input to check your program this is the 2023 coding template and you have to just check this okay to check your own uh, own input okay so you have to insert your input like one two three four five six in, and anything then you have to check if your code is well or matching with the sample input or not okay sample output or not so i hope you understood okay so now let's talk about the real time coding environment okay so accenture mainly uses uh, platform like metal or higher pro once you log in you will find an interface that's user friendly and equipped with all the necessary tools okay actually the coding window typically has three main sections one is problem statement second one is coding area and third one is output or console area so okay now let's talk about some common challenges candidates face and how to tackle them okay so understanding the problem this is the first thing and second one is age cases you have to think about potential edge cases and include them in your testing and third one is efficiency okay optimize your code for time and space complexity okay to excel in the coding round consistent practice is the key okay so utilize resources like lit code and practice of course practice the previous year questions so we have our prime materials where you will get all the previous year coding questions with answers so previous year all cognitive and technical part mock test as well right so to get that knock me at by insta id instagram.com slash techno.tf or you, if you don't have instagram account then please damn our telegram channel t.me slash if you can now okay i hope i'll give you okay so i hope you found this video helpful right so if you found this video helpful then please subscribe this channel and watch the playlist regarding accenture or any company that you want and if you found this video helpful then please share this content with your friends so that they can also take help from this okay so thank you for today's session